Hello, I am coming on to do a reading for the collective. It's just going to be a general energy check-in, so it may or may not resonate with you. Just take what resonates and leave what does not. Don't make something fit your situation if it doesn't fit or does not make sense for you. Okay, I hope everyone's doing well. I'm just going to shuffle and then I'll pull the energy around the reading and pull the reading, okay? Spirit, what is the energy around this reading? Okay, um, I feel like there could be something that's balancing out right now for you. Um, this could be, it could be something that's working in your favor. It could have to do with, like, the legal system. Like, maybe, um, you have something with, um, could, like, have to do with, like, a court case or something that's going in your favor. If not, there's just something that's going in your favor that has to do with some sort of, um, balance being brought in that's making you I feel like fulfilled emotionally um yeah find, find a balance is on the bottom so there could be something that is being um I feel like brought into like um uh, more of an even type of um like bringing like a scale like balancing out the scales or bringing something into like um more of um let me see okay um yeah I just feel like something could be being brought into balance that's bringing you into more hope or making you feel a sense of feeling more whole maybe um there was something that was out of alignment or there was something that was off that was making you feel a state of lack or like out of balance in a way and maybe um whatever is being brought like a form of justice to is helping you feel, find like clarity or feeling more at peace or um yeah more grounded um I think there could be like a lot of positivity when it comes to the uh, growth or going through some sort of growth that is bringing in some sort of emotional stability um, that is helping you feel more hopeful. I, there could be... Um, let me see. I'm trying to see. I'll just do this a different way. Okay. So, I'm going to read this a different way. Um, so, I do feel like there's some sort of change that's bringing in a sense of balance when it comes to justice or this is the overall energy. I feel like there's something being balanced out when it comes to some form of justice that's being brought in. Um, justice talks about a balance in a situation that was not, um, that was not, there was something that was out of alignment that was throwing, um, making like something seem unfair or like, um, something was going more in one favor than the other. But I feel like there was this sense of hope being brought in that was bringing, um, uh, positive feelings of wholeness or fulfillment and maybe it had to do with an agreement that you came into that brought emotional fulfillment or growth around emotional fulfillment that brought out positivity that uh, like aligned the scales of justice to go more in your favor this could have been an agreement when it came to any type of like 
um, agreement could have been like marriage or like um, any type of document that you have to like be like in a commitment around it doesn't have to be a document but it could be or it's just an agreement that you have in some way um could even just be an agreement that you're committed to like with like yourself or something that you are in agreement with when it comes to some sort of growth that you're in where you are finally seeing some sort of justice um go in your favor to something that you've put like the seeds of growth into and you're seeing pay off in some way okay so I'm gonna clarify this <clears throat> I'm gonna clarify this overall energy okay Okay, so I feel like um, there's a cycle opening up. There is this new door, or this new chapter opening up for you where you're coming into this uh, feeling of wholeness or overall fulfillment, or you could be in some sp sort of spotlight or have some sort of spotlight on you, and this could be the justice that's coming in. You may have had a lot of burdens that you were carrying or a lot of um, weight that you were carrying around um trying to make something work or go in your favor this is like trying to come into some sort of uh lavish type of lifestyle or a state of like not having to worry about um like wanting to be able to afford a lifestyle where you didn't have to worry about um like the <laughs> being able to afford like the luxuries of life so you didn't have to worry about the little things or didn't have to worry about the things that um like um bills and stuff like that being able to afford to be able to pay your bills so that you could also afford like the nicer things in life and i feel like um there was this maybe agreement maybe something you signed or this clarity that was brought in it could have been um some sort of uh some sort of thing that went in your favor that was emotionally fulfilling that gave you options um that brought you into a sense of hope I feel like this is some sort of growth that you went through, but whatever this clarity was that came in, um, it may have been a long road, a long path that you went down to to come into this clarity or this growth or this um, commitment that you came into. It could have been something that you spoke about around some sort of truth, um, around an idea, around some sort of truth that you had, but I feel like this was a long pathway that you went down where you had a lot of anxiety or you were in your head a lot around whether this was going to be fulfilling or if this was going to be successful. But I feel like in the end it did work out um, positively and this type of um, outcome you wanted to see where you didn't have to worry about maybe the things like um, worrying about your bills or the things like that may um, be like a large burden became uh, like fulfilled in some way where you're able to not have to worry about that and be able to um kind of relax and enjoy the space you were in in life and so i feel like this was the fulfillment that you wanted to come into or the success that you wanted to see where things were going in your way where there was um emotional fulfillment and maybe this doesn't have to do with being committed but being more like in a commitment to your success or a commitment to seeing success within the growth that you've come into around some sort of um some sort of like some sort of success that you wanted to see as far as like a job a career um some path that you were on where you wanted to see like you in some successful spot in your life um so I feel like um, you could have been in a place where you didn't have options or there were not a lot of options open for you. And because of 
some sort of positive type of communication you were giving yourself. Maybe you were feeding yourself positive affirmations or you continue to think positively. You came into a sense of hope where you were able to come into more options or you were able to make um, a lot of your dreams become reality and things go in your favor and come into a lot of growth around being able to like plant um the like seeds of new ideas that became um i feel like uh like the foundation or the the foundation or the um <coughs> the the shift that needed to happen for some sort of change in your life to bring forward like um i feel like the the seeds that you planted around some sort of idea okay sorry i had to go do something but i was saying that um i do feel like there was a shift in your foundation um with the tower here and i feel like it happened from whatever ideas that you had planted around could have been some sort of path that you were on that was bringing you into your fulfillment there was a shift that happened in your foundation that kind of could have shook you up or caused like a change in your reality but it was to bring you into success um so like success that was going to bring you into your overall fulfillment um it may have made you feel really burdened or it may have made you feel like things weren't going in your favor like you didn't have options as far as like feeling hopeless or not being able to feel positive um feeling like the growth that you had put in or the growth that you had put towards feeling like whole or like things weren't like justified with like what was happening happening wasn't justified like there could have felt like there was a lot of illusions or there was like a lot of even like things being done against you in a way that was making you feel burdened but I feel like a lot of this can feel like this when there is like a tower or like uh, something happening to our foundation but a lot of times when when we're in that moment we what we don't see or what we don't have clarity I think we even have clarity here yeah with the ace of swords what we don't have clarity around is that when those towers are happening and when we're in those moments it's um usually an upheaval to bring us into our overall fulfillment or to shake us up so that we can come into success um and not really notice you know like so that we can come out of this like perspective of looking at what's around us or the ideas or the perspectives of others around us and notice the fulfillment in front of us and drop the burden of what other people think and what other people are saying and pay attention to what's in front of us because a lot of times what's in front of us is is our fulfillment and we're too busy looking at what other people are saying and what other people are doing to gain the clarity that the positivity that we're looking for is in front of us and is not, you know, with what the crowd or what the people around us are saying. And so I feel like whatever upheaval or whatever this was that happened to your foundation was to have things turn in your favor so that you could come into the options of knowing that the clarity you needed to gain was right in front of you. And if you could let go of the burden and come into this growth to see that the shake or the uproot in your foundation was to see make you see the fulfillment that was in front of you you would be able to rest and come out of maybe the anxiety that you were going through okay